Hello, I am Professor Stephen Abbott. Welcome to another of my VR science apps. This one is Polymers and Solvents, and you can find it on my Practical Solubility website. As it's VR, you need a Vive or an Oculus to be able to experience it. This gives you an idea of what it can do. We have a box, and we have eight polymer chains inside it. It's a small box, so this is a concentrated polymer solution. The colour of the chains is just for the eye, and they're curled up just for convenience at startup. Let's get them running. And after a short time, they start to unwind and curl to give a random configuration. And if I want to, I can look the radius of gyration or the end to end distance as a statistical average. This is a so-called theta solvent where the solvent and the polymer have no preference between each other. Let's change that. Let's have the relative attraction negative so that the polymer really prefers itself over the solvent. And very quickly it coils in on itself and not surprisingly as you get this big blob it'll fall out of solution. Let's do the other extreme where the polymer really prefers the solvent and now it spreads out. There's a significant difference between the two cases other than solubility. Here the chains are extended so there's a very big chance that they can overlap with each other and therefore the viscosity is relatively high. If I go to somewhat lower interactions, say like this, then the chains start to curl in on themselves rather more and so they won't interact with each other so much so the viscosity is lower. There's another effect of course which is temperature. If I cool this to 0 degrees then there's less thermal motion so the things move around rather less. If I heat it up to 100 degrees then it's all much more Because this is VR, I can do all sorts of things. I can fly in, I can look around, and as you've seen with the controller, I can change all sorts of things. I can have longer chains and less of them, and reset, and I can have a bigger box, and so forth. It's a very interesting way to explore polymer science, and in a VR headset, it's very compelling.